I want like 50 artists. 50 artists? Yeah. Like under you, you want to sign 50 artists? That's, that would be tight. I don't want 50 artists. That's too much. No. Hell no. They all going to be someone better than me. Yeah. Nah. You know what I'm saying? So it's going to be like, damn. So I'm shot the whole world. Hey, how's everybody doing? If y'all don't know who I am, let me introduce myself. I go by the name 100K Track, and I'm one half CEO of 100K Management, and my record label remains solid. But most of you guys probably know me from managing artists such as YNW Mally, King Von, and Hot Boy, just to name a few. But now, it's time to take the 100K brand to the next level. So me and my team decided to do the 100K Open Stage. We started off the audition and decided to pick five groups from the auditions to stay in the house for months to groom them before the big $10,000 showcase. Let's check out some of the artists we chose for the house. My name is TYB Chachi, I'm 21. I'm from Worcester, Massachusetts. I wanted to audition for Next to Blow because I was trying to get my music out there and I've been trying to, you know, come up out of my city for a long time. So I moved to Orlando, Florida and I heard about the opportunity. So I felt like that was a perfect opportunity for people to hear my voice and get my story out there. Hey, what's happening? My name's Greatness. My name's Greatness. I'm from Margate, Florida. I'm 24 years old. I just turned 24. My birthday, March 18th. Pisces, I guess I, I'm a fish or some shit like that. Wasso. I don't know. But yeah. I wanted to audition for the, the platform, the showcase. Cause I know I got what the fuck it takes, man. I'm talented as shit. I believe in myself 100%. No, 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 no doubt. Yo, you know what I'm saying? I'm really careful, you know what I'm saying? Sammy Zosa, man. We're the same olds. From Jacksonville, Florida. Yeah. yeah. Duval, you know? The name says so. You know what I'm saying? From me, so. Everybody know That's we are we next, had so. Audition, so we from We've been making music since we was jits, you know. Since middle school, you know what I'm saying? We always moved, made music, so. It just was asses, huh? Literally. We was jits, you know, making some dope sounds for that age at that time, so now, you know. Yeah, it started making sense around like the 2016 area, you know? Yo, it's 438 Davis. I'm KG. And I'm JB. And I'm OG. Yes, sir. There we go. <laughs> we from West Orlando, Florida. Uh, well, you know, been battling these showcases for a while now. And, um, you know, I basically had that one every showcase around. So we figured, hey, a record level in time, that pop pop, see what we could do about it. You feel me? Now, let's go check in with our ARs. You know we are looking for the next big stars to add to the 100K family, so they gotta keep their ears tuned and their eyes ready, cause you never know. Yo, what's up, y'all? What's up, what's up? <laughs> Oh, man. This shit big as fuck. What's yes, up? What's up? Crazy. What's up, y'all boys? Oh, Everybody good? This shit huge. Damn. That, that pool fat as hell. Come on, come on. I know it's about like 12 rooms in there. Welcome to the 100K house, y'all. How was y'all flight? How was everything? Good, it was good. It was good. So I'm glad y'all made it. Track got a message for y'all. Oh, shit. Track here? Track. No, no, no. He's not here. Follow me.
What's going on, ladies and gentlemen? You know who this is. It's your boy, the one and only, Big 100K, 100K Track. And I'm here to introduce you to your new house for the next couple months. Man, can you believe it? We finally here, you know what I'm saying? 100K open stage, and I'm so excited to see what y'all bringing to the table. Listen, this ain't gonna be easy, but this ain't gonna be hard. All you gotta do is stay true, stay persistent, and stay focused, because after this, Somebody's gonna win that grand prize. Somebody gonna win that 100K deal. You get what I'm saying? This is a chance of a lifetime. And right now, it's your moment. Anybody, everybody can win this. You know what I'm saying? Women, men, whatever. It's up in the air. The next couple weeks, I'm gonna have my team come by. They're gonna come talk to y'all. They're gonna come give y'all some tasks. So you might never know. I might bring some celebrity friends too. You know what I'm saying? To come through and check y'all out. I just need y'all to stay on y'all A game, stay focused, because I'm telling you, this is it. This is the moment y'all been waiting for, 100K open stage. Welcome to your new house. Hey, everything except for the fridge, you know what I'm saying? All right, y'all, I'll catch y'all later. Peace. How I feel about this whole experience, a very humbling experience, you feel me? Like, we ain't come from this shit, you feel me? Like, like I ain't never seen no big ass house like this type shit. I ain't never seen no shit like this, so. It's, it's, you know I'm very grateful to be here, no matter what. If if I win, I lose, you feel me? Whatever happens, happens, but it's a very humbling experience. I'm very, like, you know, I thank God for that shit, and yeah. What's up, y'all? My name is St. Paul. I'm the Executive Vice President for 100K Management. Uh, I see y'all got picked by my team because you guys got what it takes to be a star. Uh, you guys are going to be here for the next three days. So y'all got to get acquainted with each other because you guys are going to be on some real, real, real shit for the next three days. So be prepared. Bring everything you got and let's just make this shit happen. All right, so as we go, we're going to have challenges. So. Let's start with the first challenge as we, we just got into the house, all right? So the first challenge is going to be, you guys have to pick a beat of, of, uh, of your own taste, pick it, and then make, create a song. And you guys have one hour to create this song. Come up with the writing process, make everything happen, the body of work, and then prepare because you guys are gonna lay it down in the studio, okay? So you guys have one hour starting from now to get this going. So y'all can go, man. Yeah, boys. 
still work. Yeah, that's me. Y'all know what to do, like 30, not even. 10 minutes, write a song. What they gotta do with that? Yeah. Oh, yeah. It's about it's a hit, though. Yeah. You can take 30 minutes, but it can that be trash. You're marinating our songs to make yeah. it a hit. God damn, y'all. But it's 30. God damn, y'all gonna be a little fishy to me. Y'all better be trash. Y'all better be spitting out some fire to Y'all boy better be. Yeah, y'all ass over love, love. Shit, y'all better be in love, boy. I'm telling you. You know what we gotta do right there? We're gonna bring that fire. That's your bottle, y'all. Appreciate it. When I came in, you know, it was great energy, you know. It was most definitely happy to see me. Came in, got it cracking, you know, no bad vibes. You know, every I feel like everybody was was was, was eager to, you feel me, show what they show their special abilities and for me performance and whatnot. Definitely seeing the artists, like seeing them, like, especially at the level they at right now, make me think about where I was at. You know, when I first, like when I was at A level, I came to Miami as well. Like in the Airbnb, like nice house, feel me? Full of rappers, like it was a lot of, feel me? And all of us were just grinding every day, you know, in the studio, feel me? Like all of us have studio, different times, wanna leave, wanna come back, you know, section that, boom, boom, boom. You know, we all just ro rotating and stuff like that. I, I 
offer them advice on on shyness, like shyness. Okay, it's cool to be shy at the beginning, but you gotta get that together. You know, you can't be shy. You might be nervous. Don't be shy. Though. See what I'm saying? Greatness. He did that. I didn't know he could sing like that either. Yeah, this this one hell of an experience, especially like at their level. Like when I was at that level, it was none of this. Like this is like a cheat code. You know what I'm saying? Yo, what's up? This is Ajlo, producer, engineer for 100K. Here, meet up with these artists and see if we can make some hits today. Yo, DC. We got the same old. Kev, 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 Sammy Sosa, Sosa, you know what I'm saying? Um, you already know about these boys, man. They different. I already know. You know what I said, you already know. Let's go crazy. I seen them once live. Yeah. Got that zombie right there. You know what I'm saying? So you need like them different type sound, like you definitely. Yo. Go to different like, You know what I'm saying? I know you got some different songs. Yeah, coming with that energy. You know what I'm saying? We want to control the mind. My zombies really crazy. We never come in peace. No need for lubrication, I fucked her really grease. She asked me for the safety, I'm talking about the peace. These niggas not adjacent, they speaking on the... T come in! Come! Run, run it with a beat! My zombies really crazy, we never come in peace. No need for lubrication, I fucked her really grease. She asked me for the safety, I'm talking about the peace. These niggas not adjacent, they speaking on the team. The devil trying to break me, but can't let the freaky face me, I feel like I'm a beast A couple killers lazy, but really run the streets Yeah, Oslo, he a monster, man, he a multi The truth, you know what I'm saying? Not one time The answer, no times. questions Three times, more, probably multiple times, you know, he so, you know, he's a multi It was the greatest producer. collab, you know what I'm saying, yeah, you know, top five He gave it to us, you know, we just, he just gave us the blueprint, you know Dream good. team, Oslo, perfect assist, the greatest Sensei Yo, what's good? What's good? Hey, man, you already know. What's up? 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 With um, y'all rap group, y'all sing. Yeah, nice, nice, nice. You guys got beats on you guys, or? We got some beats, but we can't see it. What you see? Got, what you about, man? Alright, then we pull up something. Let's get to it. Right. Yeah, I, I can take my time. Looking in you, so excited. Be by the best, I don't stop it. But what's a better baby girl you got? I hope oh. that it's so right. Our experience working with Eyes Man, it was dope, man. We were just in here catching vibes and just yeah. making magic and, and you see talented, man. but it was you know, a he dope vibe. High, he got some high standards, so you know. <laughs> yeah, we had so, to like, come with it. that for sure. We had to come with it. Yeah, we came with it for sure. Mikael! What? Come on. Come through. Yo! What's up, Mike? What's up, Mike? How you doing? Got my boy Greatness here. What's up, man? Nice meeting you. You got it, honey, boy, boy. Amazing. Where you from? Brad From Brad County? Yes, what, kind of, what kind of genre you do? You rap, you sing? I'm an artist. Artist? Sing, yeah. I make tropical music. Great tropical music. music? Okay. Like dance hall vibes? Dance hall, right. Afro, R&B, universal music. So universal sound, international nice. sound. Yeah, you know all my desires. Let me tell you down my divide. Yeah, you know all my desires. I only divide my divide.
Yeah, 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 yeah. Me and Isla, like the biggest duo since John the Baptist and Jesus Christ, you know? Pablo Escobar and cocaine. I can go on and on, but you get the point. But yeah, we're amazing together. Yo, 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 yo. Let's go, bro. Yeah, chilling? Chilling, bro, chilling. I had to pay a visit for you. You already know, bro. You know, I got the artists I'm working with. Remember I told you? Yeah. She's gonna pull up. Fire. Yo. Yo. What's up? Shout out to Ice Low. Ice Low. Chopping it up. How was the ride? It was like, you for me? It was like, yeah. like you said. You from New York? Yeah. No, I'm from Boston. Oh, well, from Boston? Boston. Yeah. Okay. Yo, yeah. I was playing some beats. Yeah. I was gonna listen to some shit. Let's see what's yeah, up. Sure. Let's see that, I got bigger plans. Talking to you, we're fitting my money. Bitches, I just had him on my collection. Ask you why I'm like this, I'm a shield. I already told you I'm an evil nigga. I feel about Aslo. He's exactly like his name, you feel me? He's really laid back. We really clicked off Rip, you feel me? So we locked in, you feel me? Like, he's really strategic about the way he moves with his music. And that's how I really, I really fuck with him. Man, I'm getting sold, I'm lonely, bitch, he poking out my pants, man. I own the one, so here's so how the fuck you pulls your pants down. I'm never cuffed, bitch, most of these hoes really be fanned out. Been feeling like man now. Just came here, laid up, y'all. Did it quick, quick, and hard ass on it to make you get out your body. Do what you gotta do. Short, simple, and easy. Turn you up, get you crunk, get you sipping on that bell up. I got some for their ass that they don't stay to sleep like that. Motherfuckers intoxicated like a oh. Dang, you got bottles everywhere and shit. Shit, crazy. Man, what's going on? I know you ain't coming down with no damn pillow in your hand, bro. Hey, bro, stop playing with me, bro. Nah, oh, y'all tripping. Y'all tripping, where everybody at? Yo! Yo! Damn, Chachi, I thought you at least was gonna be up. What's going on? You're coming down with pillows, sheets. Oh yeah, this is a sleepover and shit, huh? So, ain't nobody up? Y'all see the time? It's about to be 8.30 in the morning. Y'all got nothing to do today? Everybody quiet now. What, what somebody gonna tell me what, what, why everybody sleeps so, like, so late? What's going on? What, what y'all had going on yesterday? What y'all had some strippers over here? Oh, oh, you said too much motion. Okay, it was in the ocean yesterday. So y'all think it's a joke, right? Y'all up already, ain't it? Y'all made it. Y'all in the mansion. Y'all in Miami. Y'all got the strippers, which I had some Cubans, some 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 Latinos. Hey, this man, y'all, bro, come on, bro. You got the pillow. What, what y'all hugging on the pillow for? So y'all want the pillow more than y'all want this bag. That's what it is. Hey, come here, bro. Everybody, come here, bro. We got we gotta have a serious talk. Y'all come here, bro. Like. Like, this is not acceptable at all. Like, we're not gonna do this. Like, it's about to be 8.30 in the morning, bro. You got artists going to sleep at five, catching jets at seven, getting to this bag. And they got a reason to. I'm up at five in the morning. 
y'all here sleeping at 8 30 like come on what y'all think how y'all gonna get how y'all gonna get where, where y'all want in life like this fam like y'all you never heard of early bird get the one that's cool i got something for y'all and i heard one of y'all let me say tashi and kg y'all got an altercation the other day So y'all, you got time to fight each other, but not time to wake up and get money. That same old. Was... I'm gonna fuck you up. Relax, come on, fuck you. Y'all, what's supposed to be a team? Y'all pushing each other in the motherfucking pool and shit. Y'all think I'm, I'm find out about that? That's cool. I got something for y'all tomorrow, though. Matter of fact, y'all go back to sleep. I'm gonna catch y'all tomorrow. Next time kicking everybody out the house. Okay, y'all. Today, me and the team had to get them ready for the next challenge. So I had my superstar talent, you know, hot boy, come to check them out. And I didn't really like how the challenge went. On top of them sleeping all day, plus the fight, I can't lie, I'm almost ready to send everybody home. But I decided to bring my guy, the big homie. Oh! Trap and tell me about y'all. Y'all been doing y'all little rap thing, huh? I get it. I get it. I get it. I get it. And shit. I'm gonna check y'all out, see what y'all got going on. See who do what they, what they do. I'm fuck with y'all. I like the way your body's all going on me. Too late. My fault. Hold on, let me start off. Mama told me do not roll with y'all. Mm, 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 Y'all kind of spicy, huh? Who wanna go first? Uh, come on. <laughs> <laughs> Let me see what y'all got. What I did was iniquity. I hope you piled on in me. But when love's been pain, you just can't run away. Myself every day will let me to this big mistake. Please listen, girl, to what I need to say. Cause I heard you, girl, and now I'm ready. I did you wrong, and I know you didn't deserve it. And I'm here to make it up to you. Together we will make it through. Give me a chance to prove to you that I love you. Okay. Uh, all right. All right. All right. <laughs> I get it. I get it. Uh, I have visions of us all just winning. Stacking cheese to Parmesan, Lieutenant. Kobe rings with Parker Saul attendant. I got motion, get us all up in it. Shorty looking like a Robin Givens. Why they trying to put us all in prison? In the cell, I'm paying y'all a visit. Wonder why they make us all the victim. Kill a black and you get all the riches. Kill a black and you get all the power. I can tell that you be on the powder. You cannot grow if your soul devoured. What's on my mind? I need smoke this louder. Mama told me do not roll with cows. Tell the shorty I'll be home in an hour. What's on my mind? I need... Ah.
She keep talking crazy like I went just trying to fuck that bitch. Freaky cool, a hoe walk in the trap and get the sucking dick. I can't trust nobody, I feel like them boys be counterfeit. They be talking crazy, but gon' get low in that chocolate spit. The J Bang saving that hoe, she drunk in that water, so you better floor at your boat. Niggas be ducking they smoke and see me in public and act like they don't even know. He probably got beat by the hoe. He tried to run, but the chopper cut his fucking throat. I cannot cuff no bot. We're back in that trap, trying to come on nice. Y'all, uh, y'all did something together before? No. Huh? Yeah. Y'all worked together before? Yeah, we did. I see what you did. Oh. Wow, <laughs> uh, y'all got me. All right, bet. Guitar. All pitting on a million Cause baby girl you got me blowing feathers through the ceiling I'm trying to do right All I need is you to notice Trying to make you mine I'm giving you all my focus Baby I swear that I won't walk away Cause my heart beats for you In ways I can't explain I got some scars up inside It's hard to let them show When I look in your eyes I gotta let you know I want to take you to paradise. I want to take you, take you, yeah. You inspire my melody. Baby girl, you're the one for me. Yeah, she like my tongue on a go. Yeah, she like the way I make a show, show. Yeah, 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 yeah. I want to take you to paradise. Oh my God. I did, I did. You and me and Green. You and me and Green. The greatest, you know. I get it. You look so good. You look so good. But you ain't my type of hot baby. You ain't my type of hot baby. You look so fine. You look so fine. But you ain't my type of hot baby. Ain't my type of hot baby. Let me tell you by the time I bust around me, got a honey that I was really fine. I came up from the bottom. Now nah, a nigga looking super fly. Couldn't tell me shit. She digging all my flaws and all. Pull up on you quick, just tell me when you getting off. I'm rolling, rolling, rolling when she tell me I can slide. I tell her that I love her, but she think I'm telling lies. Can't be kept the truth. I would give you my heart, but that shit really hard to find. I want to taste you, I'm just trying to find a recipe. I want to beat it, but I catch a felony. Trying to keep a hood, girl, you don't know what I'm <laughs> Last but not least. We get some guitar, huh? Yeah, I'm sorry. You don't want to play that. Sure. Nah, that's part of me. You going off me? Both of me. I got the devil on my shoulder, can't get him off of me. I rolling off a of perkin' when that nigga talk to me. He told me this is how it's like supposed to be. To keep one in the holster while you rolling in the streets. They plotting this to end the best of me. But I can't let them, I weigh at the bottom Not half these niggas ain't on my level, keep a 38 special Oh, that my favorite type of metal, cold nights I wish for better, burn them up, won't change the weather And I lost so many, they bought them on the highway Give up by the opera, we catch a lack and then it's die they, they say I ain't hot, but I'm too hot just like a five play Simple six, two, some up, and even leaking in this driveway I'm bleeding red, real spill, I put you niggas scared Real stuff is my move inside and keep one in the head We did them wrong, but he made his bed Yeah. <laughs> yeah, we got to buy me up. Don't make me fuck around and catch.
Oh, I got all these bitches up on my fucking body. Uh, and they, they slime. And we divide them. Uh, we give them. And you know we get no violence. And we don't see no competition. It's just me and you. And Lil Jake, because you know that's my little crew. Hey. So what it is, and what a nigga wanna do. This on my dome. I swear to God, it's a pushed out. And if you. <laughs> 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 hey, you know <laughs> 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 Before we get into how y'all did and stuff, any advice on music y'all want to ask me? Industry, anything. What keep you pushing? What keep you going? Yeah. What, where you from? You from Bahamian? I'm from Florida. I'm, what's, what's your... Haitian? Okay, okay. You know the style, by the way. Okay, I get it, I get it. What keep me pushing? Um, I actually rap for people who... This, this was their dream. I ain't, I ain't, they started me rapping, they made me get in the studio. Both of them died, so I kind of feel like if I, you know, I had the opportunity to keep going, if I didn't, I feel like I'd be like spitting in their face. You know what I'm saying? So sometimes I gotta remind myself of why I'm doing it. You know what I'm saying? Cause you can't, you know, I, I love music, but you can't follow, you, 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 I love music, but I hate the stuff that's involved in it. So it can defer you sometimes. Probably like, no, that's all type of shit, fuck. Uh, clearances, paperwork, people not signing paperwork, people don't wanna give you, like when you get a song done, you gotta get all type of clearances, so you gotta get uh, video rights. To, you might shoot a video, you might spend 100,000 on a video, but motherfucker don't sign that paper, that video can't come out, nigga pull that motherfucker down. So you just spent all this money for nothing. So, bunch of shit like that. Um, motherfuckers. Uh, be in your DM saying they love your music, see you in public, they don't want to speak to you because they cool with somebody else, stuff like that. Weird shit. What do you think is like the most important thing like focus on? Focus. Focus is a big word. I feel like with this music industry, you got to uh, gotta be focused. Um, you got to stay hungry. Just for instance, right? I just listen to all y'all music, right? As far as right now, all y'all trash. Like garbage. If you ain't been to jail, you bitch ass niggas. You know what I'm saying? You ain't like that. Shit like that. See how y'all just laughed and shit like that? You still focused, you ain't care about what I said. See, if you would've got upset right now, you was all focused. Cause right, like right now, I can check my DM on me. I'm all type of bitch ass niggas and shit like that. You know what I'm saying? So focus, that's a big word. You know about it? Huh? One, one more time. How you handle all the women? Women? Yeah. Oh, women. Damn, well, when I first started, right? So, mind you, I come from Baton Rouge, Louisiana. I come from two, doing 100, $200 shows. So, I'm doing these shows with these thousand people that, thousand people that are getting 30, 40 grand a night, stuff like that. You know, we indulge. But, at some point, you either gonna keep going this way or you gonna keep going that way. I just, it ain't interesting no more. You know what I'm saying? So I'm trying to, trying to be more happy. So I don't really mess with my fans no more. <laughs> Anybody else? All right, bet. Uh, y'all was nice. I like y'all the melodies and stuff. Y'all kind of cheated. You know, I didn't know y'all worked together. <laughs> Y'all good. You, I liked your flow. You fell off, you should've just picked it right back up. I ain't want you to stop. Uh, I respect you, Mean Green. I respect it, yeah. You, same way as him. You know what I'm saying? Maybe, I think y'all was just in each other head a little bit. Guitar, I fuck with your swag. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> I fuck with your swag. Y'all, I can tell y'all work with each other. You know what I'm saying? I really wanted to see y'all uh, spit together. I wish I would have did y'all together. I'm trying to do that shit. 
YouTube. Which one it was? Oh, bam, bam, bam. We missing somebody? Oh, I'm tripping. Who's your partner? It was, no, you, you, I'm, I'm sorry. At first, you wasn't really, you were kind of nervous. You know what I'm saying? Just had, when you would be up there, like I say, focus. Don't give a fuck about what I think. You up there, you put your swag on, get that shit out, you know what I'm saying? Y'all yeah, too nice. Yeah. Uh, I say, I would say y'all won, but y'all work together already. So that's my fault. Y'all two definitely got it. Y'all took the cake. Um, um, yeah, other than that, uh, track gonna have something for y'all, the winners. But all y'all did y'all thing. Uh, any other questions, y'all, any advice? Get ready for the music industry. <laughs> I chose Chachi and KG, you heard me? Because I felt like, well, I could tell they was coming with a freestyle. More, it's more creative, you know what I'm saying? More diverse. Being chose as a winner, um, I feel like it was crazy. I ain't thinking it was going to win because we had a lot of people doing a lot of great things. We had boys playing guitars and singing, and we were just coming, rapping, you feel me? But at the end of the day, we took that. Being a star, you gotta have that swag, that natural swag about you. That's what I like about KG. You know what I'm saying? I can tell she owning what she doing. And the way we was able to squash that beef when Chuck talked to us. Y'all two really the weakest link in here. Everybody else here singing, playing guitars, doing moonwalking. Like y'all just coming out there with straight vocals, so y'all really gotta step it up. You feel me? Like we realized that, that shit like. I mean, that was just some petty shit, you feel me? Like, this shit business, we gotta take our music shit serious type shit, you feel me? Like, and it's crazy because we ain't even know if we get up together and we actually, like, you know, work together. That shit came out crazy, you feel me? We ended up winning the whole competition. The energy I got from the artists, uh, I see hunger, I see talent, uh, good vibes, you know what I'm saying? But I see they want it, you know? So my boy, the bang man, you know, Fredo, came to check out the talent. And Chachi and KG won the challenge. So I decided to take them to my main man, my guy, the homie, you know what I'm saying? Jay. If y'all don't know, Jay's responsible for signing a lot of big stars, such as Fredo Bangs, YNW Melly, and plenty more. He's one of the biggest executives in the game right now. I'm talking about making things shake from Florida all the way to New York. So if they could impress him, yeah, it's a done deal. Man, so Jay, how you living, bro? I'm just working, man, you know me. All night, just, all day working. Just staying on it, man. 24 hour business. Man, I'm not gonna lie, bro. I've been, it's been a headache for me. You know, I don't put like, what, five artists, 10 people in one house for this um, 100K open stage. Just trying to find the next superstar, but you know, I'm trying to do it a different way. Man, I've seen you with the, you know, I've been talking to you about it. Whenever I see the, the, the showcases, and yeah. I see the turnout, I'm like, man, you're going crazy. Just the fact that so many people come out, they drive from out of town, they come oh, from different states. Everywhere, bro. Like, this is, it's crazy, and it's a dope thing because I know you really gonna give somebody an opportunity out of it. Right, and there's um there's a couple I'm not gonna lie, man. there's a couple people in the house that they got it. Like mm -hmm. you know you got the artists that go out there and rap, but you got the ones that's playing guitar. You got the ones that sing and dancing. Like I really feel like everybody in that house got potential, like got a potential to be a superstar. But I'm trying to find them. I don't know though. It's like it's like a toss up though between like two or three. You know what I'm yeah. saying? You know, I had, I had your boy Fredo come to the house to, to check. He thought it was going to be a, a walking apart. Now, he was telling me stuck. about it. He was telling me about it. I talked to him before he went over there. Yeah. Oh, yeah? yeah what what we, we was he going to say you about it? He was, he was telling me, like, you know, he heard about what you were doing. He was, he was like, man, I'm going to go over there. I'm going to be hard on the artist. Right. I'm like, come <laughs> on, man. You know what it's like when you're an artist, when you're passionate about something, you're not going to show up and actually, like, go hard on them. You try to be the troll. Yeah. <laughs> and then... You know, I think he went there and he was actually like, oh shit, like, there's some talent here. Yeah. Nah, the um, the two, because like, what, what he had, I had him do, right? 
So basically, there's ten, there's ten contestants, right? Yeah. But it's five groups. So he came and randomized and put whoever he felt like it, cause he he don't know who's who, who what group is what, right? So he had to do like a a two on two competition. So it was a, a five teams, but two. And I'm not gonna lie, he ended up picking two winners. And it was the toss up between those two that in my head, I'm like, okay, from the house, from just watching the competitions, from just watching like how they carry themselves, I'm really thinking like one of those two gonna have it. And there are only two females in the house. But let me ask you this, right? Because like me knowing you for as long as I know you and you know, even working with you and even working with somebody like Fredo, right. where he's now like four years in to what he's been doing since he came home from jail, not even counting what he did before, right? Right. First make a name. Yeah, he's been putting that work too. Man. And you know how long you've been working? This is ten years in the making. Facts. Maybe more. Facts. Like my bad if I'm wrong, but you know what it is. It's nah, a lot it's of definitely work. Definitely right? over ten years. It's a decade. And you feel like you finding that energy in that house? Like because you know what it takes. Talent is one thing. Right. They're showing you they can sing, they got bars. They, is See, it, have you felt the hard work that's, yet? That's the thing, right? There's some days that- The determination. Right, there's some days, you know what I'm saying, like my staff come by and I'm seeing the footage and you've seen arguments, you've seen petty fights. You're like, you know what, I don't know. They might not want it bad enough, but there's, there's some days where you see the creativity and the talent the drive. And that's where I'm stuck right now between, between like three or four, Cause you kind of you don't need two three months to see it like somebody who wanted. Yeah. And these last couple of weeks, I've really been seeing like Chachi, and KG, mm -hmm. and Kelly's vibes. I've been seeing like they they work at the like yeah. they wake up in the morning they riding like you see yeah. everybody in the pool bringing girls over. They in, the, they in the lab, you know. And that's the type of energy. That's the type of effect I feel like make a superstar. Cause there's too many. Everybody's talented nowadays. But those three. I think they got it. And that's the problem I'm having today, man. I, I want to introduce you to the two that actually won the competition with Fredo. I just want to try to fill them out and see if you see what I see. Because yeah. it's it's a tight race. It could. I'm not gonna lie. It's a toss up. But I think those two, they got they got my they got my eyes on. You know what I'm saying? Like I, I see the hunger. I see the passion. Now that's big coming from you. Right. Thanks. Right. I want to check them out, man. Let me check them out. I got them. I got them in the car. Get them out. Yo, hey, y'all come up. Yeah, the top floor. And bring your A game too. <laughs> Alright, for sure. Yo, what's up, Track? What's the word? What's up, man? Yes, sir. How you so, doing? I'm KG. Jay, nice to meet you. Nice, nice to meet you. you. How you doing? Jay, nice Gosh. to meet you. Already y'all won the competition with Fredo. For sure, for sure. We did that shit. We killed it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. How that's been feeling this whole ride? You know, y'all with track, which is, is huge. Whenever he focuses on something, yeah. he makes it a real thing. Yeah. It's it been real good, you know. We've been chilling, getting work done, you know. It's a real nice experience. Yeah. You know, it's out here in Miami. What's the work been? What he got y'all doing? Like we been like going to the studio, mm -hmm. uh, making cover arts and doing a lot of stuff to help us gain marketing, stuff like that. Yeah, that's what's up, that's what's up. So, so how long you been making music? Been making music for about two years now, but I've been rapping longer than that. Mm -hmm. So I started taking it serious like two years ago. Yeah. Yeah, so now it's time to get right. Yeah. So, so you know when you lock in, if you win this whole thing, you know you lock in with track. Then, yeah, for sure. For sure. Everything you've done is is cool. That's how you that's how you practice. But then the real work kicks in. Yeah. You know, I'm gonna be just, ready for it. Yeah. I'm ready for whatever. Cause that's just the start. That's just like the time to go harder. Mm -hmm. Time to get get in my grind mode. You feel me? Mm -hmm. That's what's up. That's what's up. So Chachi, where you from? I'm from Boston. You know, KG. KG from Orlando, where are you from? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm from Boston, but I moved out here probably like four months ago. Uh-huh. Yeah. That's what's up. You moved where? To Orlando. Orlando. And how, how this whole experience been? Rocking with track and just... It's been a very humbling experience, you feel me? Because, like, 
I ain't never seen no shit like this before. Like, yeah, I was doing music, my little videos and shit, but this is a whole nother type of level. It's like movie shit, you feel me? So. And how does yeah. it feel to like, you know, you start doing what you're doing, you know, aspirationally, you find out that you're talented, that you can make music, but how you been feeling to see that it could be real? Like, you know, you were somebody that really knows how to take it the whole way, and then, you know, you're getting around more recording studios, people yeah. that have actually done this. Like, how are you taking that in? Well, I feel at home. Like, you feel me? Like, I've been wanting this shit my whole life type shit. Like, I knew I didn't want to work no regular job. I didn't want to, you feel me? I want to put my pain in this shit. Like, I got a story to tell, you feel me? So, mm -hmm. I know I'm in the right place, I'm in the right hand. How you started making music? I started, like, you feel me? Just fucking around. I used to be drunk with my friends and shit, going through shit. Like, you feel me? I started, like, writing shit. And then my friends told me, like, on beats, they're like, yo, get in the studio. Once I got in the studio, my um, engineer actually, he kind of took me in as a father type shit. Like, I used to sleep there type shit because I was just bouncing around, you feel me? Mm -hmm. I would just keep recording, recording myself. I learned how to record myself a little bit. So, yeah. That's what's up. That's what's yeah. up. So, you make music about what you feel, what you're going yeah, through. Yeah, for sure. That's right. amazing. No, but I love that story about you guys, like, you know, just jumping out there and giving this a chance and, and then, you know, being, being hungry and, you know, that, that thing that you guys, that moment when you guys felt like you were gonna be uncomfortable and really pursue this and, you know, being hungry for it, you guys gotta keep that. Because that's really the X factor between being talented and taking it the whole way and like achieving where you wanna go, achieving that level of finances, achieving that level of success and living your dreams out is, is how hungry you are at all times. Because the followers can trick you. The million views, the million streams, they can trick you, you're not there yet. You guys keep that hunger that you're talking to me about, that's what takes you the whole way. And I've seen it. I've, I've worked with artists that, that that is the determining factor. You know, you don't break right away. It, you see it happen, but what really keeps you there is years of hard work and years of dedication. So I, I love that. I love that. Man, I appreciate y'all for coming through. You know what I'm saying? I'm chopping it up with Jay. Think about y'all, see if y'all yeah. got what it takes. Great to meet you guys. Yeah, nice best of luck with everything. Sure. Nice to meet you. Man, Jay, bro, I appreciate you, dog. Man, you already know, man. Take time out your busy yeah. schedule for me. I know, you know, you got and this extravagant lifestyle, Miami vibes, to go going. Man, come know? on, man. <laughs> nah, you know I'm gonna make time for you whenever, man. I love what you're doing. I love what you're doing. So what you think? Because, you know, away from the competition with Fredo, I, I really think one of them two got it. I tell you, man, I know whenever you pick who you're gonna take a chance on, it's gonna be for a reason. I like their vibe. I felt like KG, she has something about her where she, she comes off fearless. Right. She looks like she's ready to go. Also, one thing, one thing I gotta tell you, Chachi, she wants it. She wants it, I think. You can tell, you can tell her, her demeanor. Yeah, the way she talks, her story, and even when she was talking about it, she meant it. She wasn't just trying to tell that story to, to sound good. She she told it like, this is what it is. And I was really hungry. Yeah, <laughs> like, and, and I still felt it now. Yeah. I feel the hunger and that's special. I like that about her a lot. I appreciate you, bro. I'm gonna let you get back to your, you know what I'm You already know, man. Night. Yeah. I'm gonna catch you and um, we'll yes, see sir. who win this. You know I, wanna, I wanna see too. I wanna Shelter, see too. Shelter. Man, look. This is exactly what I wanted to see. I wanted to see like what would bring like, you know what I'm saying, like the best out of these six talented talents. You know what I'm saying? You got 438 Baby, you got Same Old, you got Careless Vibes, then you got Greatness and you got Chachi all in one building. Today is the big day of the showcase and we've been working extremely hard and I definitely couldn't do this alone. So before we get started, let me let some of my 100K team members introduce themselves and let you guys know exactly what we're looking for. What's up, y'all? It's Drew Filmed It. I'm the president of 100K. If Drew didn't film it, it ain't film right. So whoever filmed it, I don't know who did. This take on the competition is really good. A lot of people can get on a platform they never received. A lot of people network together. Um, the best advice I feel, I feel like I could give to an artist is like, just be yourself, be genuine. Um, I feel like throughout my whole career, I was just genuine and help people out, help other people out. Don't always be about yourself, don't be selfish, and don't cause no negative attitude. Be positive and get rich together, you know what I'm saying? Hey, it's your girl Spode, product manager with 100K. 
I will be an event coordinator out there. So bring your A-game, bring your talent, make sure your image on point too, because you never know who's going to be in the building and get ready to become a star. What's up, what's up, man? It's your boy Gabo here at 100K. I'm one of the A&Rs as well as one of the creative minds handling all the merch and apparel here that we do. Um, what I want to see out of the performance is originality. I want to see some raw talent. I don't want to, you know, care for the club songs. I want to see people talk about life. I want to hear life songs. I want to hear real stories. I want to, I want to, I, I just ready for something real, you know, that's all. What's up, guys? It's DC, A&R 100K. Um, I'm also one of the event coordinators for the open stage. And guys, please bring your A game out there. We're trying to change somebody's life. You know what I'm saying? We're gonna have decision makers in the building. So y'all bring your A game, y'all look right, have your lyrics on point. You know what I'm saying? Come prepared and we're gonna see what it do. We're gonna see who's next up, who's next to blow. Yo, what's good y'all? It's your boy Who Frame Roger. I am Hot Boy's official DJ, as well as the head event coordinator and a member of the creative team here at 100K. When you come to that open stage and you see me, make sure you have that music ready. I wanna see that stage presence and make sure you come with it. What's up? It's your girl, AA Love. My role with 100K is co-CEO, working alongside 100K Track. 100K open stage is good to the community as far as like getting out um, awareness of talents, more so, cause you know, music is one of the core parts in this world and everybody, some people have a gift of music, so. Might as well use it and find the next big thing. Prizes that we're giving out is gonna be huge, big. You already know, we got Drew filmed it. You can get you a music video. We giving away 10 bands. And we got DJ Academics in the building, period. So y'all better bring it. Stop playing with it. There you have it. Couldn't have said it any better myself. Words from the 100K team. Now, it's time to get the showcase started. I had artists from all over coming to be in it. So we had to choose a few others with a little bit, you know, a little bit more potential to speak on what they have going. Yo, what up? My name is Aaron. Everybody call me AC3. I'm um, 20 years old. I'm from Lake Butler, Florida. August will make two years. So like summertime 2020, I started. And I, what made me start was I had a cousin who was making music and he passed in a car accident. So my brother-in-law, he was like, I'm gonna I'm a keep making music, keep it going. I'm proud of Aaron that he stepped out on his own to do something that he had a dream for. The next five years, I'll say I'll easily be top five in the game. Once Aaron got out on his own, I was I was really really proud of him. Just look out for the name AC3 everywhere. My artist name is Tay Gutter. Um, I'm from right here in Orlando, Florida, West Orlando to be exact. Um, 438. Um, I wanted to audition for Next to Blow because I should be the next one to blow because, you know, I'm hot, I'm fire. I'm working hard. I'm bringing what I gotta do. I'm putting the city on. My name is Alexis, and I knew Tay for maybe about two years. He actually became very good. When I first heard him rap, he was kind of, it was funny when he freestyles sometimes, cause you know, he used to like say the same thing sometimes. I'm out this bitch for real. That's his favorite line. I'm out this bitch for real. That's what he say the most. But he actually got better. Overall, when he write, he actually way better. He like the best rapper. After that, you know, I started sitting in the room a lot, writing, writing, writing. Just trying to, you know, just trying to find myself with the, with the music. <laughs> I see 
being signed. Either signed or, or, or making money where you know he's comfortable. I want the world to know, man, just look out for me, man. Take gutter, all platforms. I'm rocking out, I promise you that. Yo, you know what I'm saying? I'm really careful, you know what I'm saying? Sammy Zosa, man. We the same olds. From Jacksonville, Florida. Oh, yeah. yeah Duval, you know? The name you say itself, you know you feel me? So, everybody know that's we all we so. audition, so we feel me? Same modes are creating a whole nother sound like the world is sleeping. Really, we in our own lane, you feel me? Nobody, nobody not fucking with us, man. I'm like, nobody. <laughs> Takeover coming, you know what I'm saying? Everybody know it, you know what I'm saying? We going crazy. Big game, man. Big polo in this big Yankee. Let's get it, man. Polo Yankee, man. Plug only little once. I'm 19. Shit, uh, I'm from, originally from Atlanta, Georgia, Fulton County. That's why I think I'm so talented. Cause I'm from the A. But we moved down here to Florida uh, when like I was like seven. Moved down here with my mom and my grandmother and my older sister. So ever since then, we just been down here in Florida hanging. Lily needs uh, a go-getter, and once he makes his mind up on what to, what he wants to do in his life, then he will. One thing about Polo Youngin that separates him from the other youngins that might be out there is first his consistency, um, his persistency, and, and his whole vibe. It's just the whole origin of Polo Youngin. <laughs> Focused on my bag, bro. you know, music, you know what I'm saying? Helping my mama and my people out, you know. My name, I go by is Big Juice 438. I'm from West Orlando, Florida, Silver Star to be exact. Um, and the reason I wanted to perform for the open stage is because I've been going so hard for so long and I just felt like it's time for me to let everybody else hit this. And I knew that once I got on the stage and rapped, that it was gonna start my journey for real. Whenever an event that happens, we're there. We have family in the Bahamas that playing the music. His father is in the Bahamas and he have the, you know, his, his clubs playing his music. So we, he, he does have a great following and a great support. He has a great support team. They asked to buy some of my inspiration and I, you know, you are one of the main ones. I just wanted to let them see you or hear your voice and see this sweet lady that been in my life all this time. So I'm trying to put them in somebody else's life, you know what I'm saying? So they can see that Granny is that lady. Well, I'm happy to know that I've made some influence on you anyway. So you continuously to go. Do you? Do what you gotta do, baby, okay? Yes, ma'am. <laughs> Like, my dog been waiting on this moment. My dog been waiting on this moment. Don't cry, then I'm gonna cry. Damn, God, I'm gonna talk some gangster shit to you, dog. <laughs> no, oh. don't cry, cuz don't cry. No, you been waiting on this moment. 
the rap on the beat, let the beat listen to the beat. I let it take me, I guess. said that we didn't do nothing but say careless vibes was coming and the crowd just went crazy that was all y'all <laughs> that was love. hey what's up y'all i'm Devin jelly what's going on y'all it's your boy prince jay Reed. it's your boy free baby and i'm Chris nick and we are careless vibes Really excited to work with 100K, man. Like, they're they have so many great artists, so many great people on the team, and you know we're just really excited to you know take this thing to the next level and just work, work, work. Fulfill our purpose, Lord. Guide us and protect us. Keep us together. Keep us safe. In your precious name we pray. Amen. Amen. Uh, hello, everyone. I am Drew York. And I'm from Lake City, Florida. Hello, bro. Welcome to 100K Open Stage, bro. How you feeling tonight? I'm feeling mighty fine. Hey, when you get that 10 piece tonight, bro, what you finna do with that? I can only show you. I can't tell you. <laughs> that real, that real. Hey, wish you good luck tonight, brother. Hope you get that. And here we have the famous Nene, which is my who is my mother. Okay, to the camera. Good afternoon, everyone. And my real name is Eugenia Harris. Jordan has always been an outgoing child. Uh, loved to dance. He's been dancing since he was, I just, he always danced. So he, he just loves music. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Y'all ass down. I learned that shit too, you know what I'm saying? Moving too fast. The Red Queen's race. Run fast just to stay in place. Yo, higher power here, HP. OBE is the game. Um, I'm from Union County, Florida. My way at Gainesville. Um, I'm 33 years old. The reason why I auditioned for the uh, Next to Blow is uh, I'm trying to eat, man. I got a whole gang. I got a family behind me and really trying to do some things. And I see I'm taking all chances at all costs, you know what I mean? So when I heard that they was when I heard that they was doing auditions and everything, said I was ready. Me and the gang got up, we got our money together and shit. We took off the Orlando so we get now. His music, what about um, it? it speaks for itself. It speaks for itself. It's amazing. Like he, he's very talented. Like he's, his music, he crafts it. Put it that way. He, he, it's a process. It's really a process. It ain't something he can just go in there and go in the studio and just go. Up. He really crafts his music. He takes it. It's, it's art. So it really is. Art. OB is going to the start. That's it. My musical journey started because of church music, drums, you know, playing in the church and shit like that. That's what started the, the musical journey, really. My inspirations now, I really like, I fuck with, you know, Davido, Thug. That's really my shit.
something good comes out of everything. You just gotta put your mindset like that. I really don't, if you think about them as like challenges or like obstacles, then I don't know, that's just scary. Those words sound scary to me. I'm a curator. I'm greatness. Vacuum Seal Hefe, you know what the fuck going on. Can't know Ohio 330 in the building. We at the event just trying to get some exposure. Out here with 100K. Drew filmed it. DJ Academics, you know what's going on. Vacuum Seal. Good, brother. So happy. Yes, sir. Hey, man, we at a hundred K open stage right now, man. I got my dog. Vacuum Seal Hefe, you know what's going on. Hey, where they could where they could find you at IG? Vacuum Seal V A C U U M underscore Hefe J E F E. My bad, brother. Introduce yourself too, bro. Nah, no, man, it's my brother though, man. My name is John Doe. Y'all you know I mean on the check in? So though. That real. Yeah. That real. Hey, man, what you finna do when you get that ten K, bro? I'm really about to just pay for another feature and get another artist so we can get, you know, mm -hmm. get popped. That's fine. Get them streams up. Yeah. Hey, man, I wish you the best of luck tonight, brother. Yep, yep. Yes, sir. Let's get that 10K, man. I really just started doing music like a year and a half ago, for real. Honestly, I moved down here, came down here. Um, my niggas called me like, bro, you, you, you be doing shit rappers do anyway. You might as well rap. I mean, honestly, I'm just being myself. So a lot of artists, they, they try to portray another nigga. I'm just gonna be myself. Vacuum seal records, versatile structure regime. Um, I mean, I got my own label. We come in, we got, our, we got our own sound. I don't sound like nobody else. I mean, tap in, just type in vacuum seal happy on any streaming platform. You gonna, you gonna see what I'm talking about. I go by the name of Ruin and I'm originally from Brooklyn, New York. Um, I currently live in Port St. Lucie, Florida. Um, I've been living here for some time now. You feel me? It's a lot of opportunities out there, and that was one of my biggest shows. There was hella people in the building as well. Well, shit, I've been making music for like three years now, going on three years, so it's like a lot. It started off at this challenge, you feel me? I was sleeping out the back seat of my car um, back in 2019, and that was one of my biggest challenges, and you feel me? Number one, my grandma. Uh, my grandma passed away in 2018, and you know, that's that's been my biggest push. She's always, she was the one who really raised me. She's, she's held down for me through a lot, and She's the reason why I go so hard in everything I do. Um, something I can tell y'all, whoever out there chasing y'all dreams, if y'all got a goal, a dream, keep going after it. Yo, it's the 438 Babies. I'm KG. And I'm JB. And you already know what the fuck going on, man. We here to take over this whole competition. 438 Babies in this bitch, nigga. And they won't even let my little YG through the door, but it's okay. I'm gonna turn up by myself, nigga. Hey, fuck you, talk about nigga. Sisters, and 
Yeah, the half rock. He the head monster of it all. He came up with the name and the brand. I'm the man of the house. That's why I get my name OG from. Take me into where the door open and I can give my life to where they ain't gotta do all the extra stuff. My name is TYB Chachi, I'm 21, I'm from Worcester, Massachusetts. I started doing music because I was going through a lot since a kid, and that was my only outlet. So every time shit would happen in my life, I would just start writing. I started taking it serious when people started telling me that my shit actually sounded good. Like, I'll freestyle with my friends, I'll get drunk, and they'll tell me, yo, you need to hit the studio. I started the studio, it was up from there, you feel me? And I had people around me supporting me, and they built me up from there. There's been a lot of challenges chasing my dream, as in like money, time. I was going through shit, you feel me? People coming in and out of my life type shit, me being homeless. Brand new 100K, y'all see the motherfucking chain, nigga? Yes, yeah. Oh, God! This is actually some unreleased. I never even showed right. it to nobody. Let's get it. Actually, nah, 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 this is Hey, if you got a cell phone, put your phone down. This is the right here, real shit. Hey, everybody put their cell phone up, man. Hey, show her love. She just got signed 100K. Everybody put their cell phone up. Show her love right now. Put your cell phone up. Right now. Right. 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 How long have you been out here? Three months? I ain't gonna fake it, right? So I'm over here, I'm sitting, I'm like, damn, hold on, I'm going crazy. And I just started thinking some shit. So I got a little something about me, right? And all the geniuses do this. Now I'm feeling like, oh, you can't call yourself a genius. I came from nothing, I came from Haiti, I'm from the slums. I made it out, bitch, I'm a fucking genius. You know what I'm saying? So look, that bitch started tricking, I'm like, damn, bitch, I'm not fucking with this shit. Right here, star. Oh, right, right, go, like, Ain't you got the young ladies, you got the females going hard. I ain't gonna fit it. It's something about you that's like real, real special to me. So you, you good on the competition. I want you to hold with me. I want you to come to Miami. Be safe. Yeah. 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 I need you to go. I need you to go get Drew. I need you to go get Drew number and A and my wife number. Yes, you, when you go, when you come to Miami, when you come to Miami, right? We gonna do, we gonna do a week. I got get a tape. If I'm lying, I'm flying. I got boss stop DQ and get back and come to the studio for a week, right? And I said this whole next week, I gotta be in the what? In the studio, right? You gonna be at that session. And if you prove it, you sign to one of the Yeah, 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 yeah. Six 
Herself present. She yeah. just leaned my lungs on her. Cassie would fall asleep literally with music, and I will I will take rides with her in the car seat and with music playing, and I will um, call her Moose. It's always been talented. that she grabbed an instrument and learned it on her own. Nobody could yeah. teach her that. She could play instruments too. Remember her Michael Jackson stage? Nisha, that was one of my friends who passed away. Um, we used to freestyle in the car before I even started this music shit. Like, we used to ride around, do horrible shit I can't really speak about. We was just bad as fuck. And we were just freestyle in the car. And like, that was one of my musical inspirations. You feel me? And I just want my story to get out there. Hey, y'all, you ain't feeling that film, right? We need energy out here. It takes a lot of courage to get up there. It takes a lot of ground to get to the point that you're even here. And I'm hoping that I'm going to see a, a couple few prospective artists that are going to be stars. This is the best point. I'm telling you, this is, this, this is what is good. It's the ground. It's that energy. So I'm hoping I'm hoping I'm, I'm going to see the next superstar here. I'm hoping I'm going to have a hand and put that person on the pedestal, OK? OK, Studio time. We got studio time. Four or five hours studio time for the whole hundred K family and the Drew Fender video. Hey, say oh, check it out. Two things happen tonight. Hey, Careless Vibes. I don't know where you at, but I want you to come to the stage, Careless Vibes. Come to the stage. The way everything happened, the way the crowd went, we had to take you out the competition because you officially signed to hundred K. Hey. So a little secret. I had to sign Careless Vibes. After I seen the crowd reaction at one of these shows, I knew they had to be 100K. I ain't gonna lie, man. Niggas really brought it today, man. There's a couple of people. I was gonna tell y'all before. I don't know who gonna win. But I seen that these four to five really talented, prospective superstars in the movie.
A Jew feel the dinner? Who is it? Uh, and an academic who is it? Uh, 438 baby! To the fans and the supporters of the 438 Babies, we love y'all. Keep supporting. There you have it, 438 Babies is the winner of the official 100K Open Stage. But there's one more person I'm proud to say is now 100K, Chachi, and y'all could learn from her. You can do anything you put your mind to, especially if you dedicate it. Always remain soft.